So Blaziken is is his star. Okay. I will say his like pot gimmick is stupid. Oh yeah, and I have Ray's special attack too. Yeah. All right, camera ups out of it. Welcome to the kingdom. I'm the king. We're back with some more Pokemon Scarlet and Violet, the Indigo Disc DLC. Let's get into this. All right, so last time we made it here to Blueberry Academy, which is in the Unova region, they gave us this new outfit right here. Uh, we met up with Carmen. We battled her. This place is all about battling. They do a lot of double battles. They have an entire like ecosystem biome in the academy itself, which is super cool. We met a new character. His name was Drayton. Um, he's the leader of the, well, not a leader. He's one of the members, the high up members of some like battling club they have here at the school, along with Kieran from the last DLC, which is the Teal Mask. He's in it and he's apparently the strongest trainer here at Blueberry Academy. And he's actually turned like kind of evil or mean. So we'll see about that. And now we got to go meet up with Drayton right now. Let's see what that's about. <clears throat> so yeah. The terrarium is what it was called, my bad. Alright, so we'll go to the cafeteria to meet him. He wanted to talk about the league club, so we'll see about that. Uh, I thought I walked right past him. And his name sounds like he's a dragon type trainer of some kind. With a team like that, you've got a shot at becoming a Blue Bear Academy League Champion. Alright. <clears throat> oh yeah, and their club has this thing called the Elite Four and a Champion, even though they're not really like their own Elite Four. Yeah, sure, I'll join, dude. Or are these Elite Four members? Or... Okay, hold on. The champion's Karen, and the rest of the four is them three. They look kind of mid, I can't lie to you. Drayden seems the coolest, and Karen. We're better than the cafeteria. Yeah, look, he changed. He changed mad. What a waste of time. Go train your Pokemon. <laughs> You'll always lose to me. Yo, he changed. He really changed. I've got your old pal with the yeah dog, I'll one v one you bro, stop fucking with me. Yeah, you a bitch now, yeah. Never about it. You look different. Yeah dude, I'm part of the school now. You thought you run shit. Nah dog. Stop fucking with me, for real. Yes yeah, he alright, Drayton seems kinda cool now. I don't know what Carmen was crying about. And who's this guy? Yeah, see, Drayden's talking fast. Why are you trying to exclude me, man? Let me, let me battle, man. Let me, let me in the club. I can beat every single one of you back to back to back. Like, stop playing with me. I've actually took on Jim's actual Elite Four members. Like, stop playing with me. Also, this guy Crispin at the right, he looks like uh, Soma from um, Food Wars. Especially holding a pot. That's not true. I've beaten you like four times in a row. What are you talking about? I should pull out the Pokemon. I could. I should pull out the... Uh, uh, what's it called, dude? The Teal Mask Pokemon. I can't remember what it's called right now, but I should pull that out on him. Because he'll cry about that. Our Crispin seems a bit lost, like just lost, a bit slow. <laughs> I 
See, and that's what I'm saying. Like this entire like DLC so far seems like actual school. Like go to register, meet this person, um, clubs, this is now like so much like actual school stuff. The main game barely had any school stuff and the other DLC wasn't even about school. I know it was a school trip, but it wasn't really about school either. Bro, you're scared of a kid who's like half your size. Like, what's going on? Dude, I destroy you. Stop playing with me. And you'll know it when I. Dude, didn't I see you like a month ago? Like, calm down, dude. Carmen's not a fan of that. Okay, so we get to explore the terrarium and battle the Elite Four at the same time. That's pretty cool. I'll battle you last because you seem like the best one. I wonder if it'll be doubles too. First, I mean, let me go back into the school now. If it's all doubles battles, that'd be pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie. Um, Oh, no way. Oh, okay. For bad points. Makes sense. I heard you're gonna need this. Uh, what else we got? Bro, he has the earthquake. I need. Alright, so this. Alright, we're gonna need a lot of battle points for this store. Alright. Alright, well, I guess in this part we're gonna take on Elite Four members and catch Pokemon probably along the way. <laughs> also, I heard Diplin has an evolution in this part, which I didn't think would go any further than that, but. That seems pretty cool. I'll probably get that. I don't want to see that new Darulodon evolution, too. Um, yeah. So 
So he's the closest one. Uh, I guess I'll face him first. But let me let me actually look around for a little bit. Okay, there's not a lot. Oh, no way. Okay, nothing's really catching my eye, I'm not gonna lie to you. Well, I passed him. Also, I wonder what level their Pokemon are gonna be. Hopefully it's nothing too... Actually, I kind of want it to be crazy. Pyroar, Magby... Vibrava, a bunch of them. To say, I was like, where is he? Savannah Plaza. All right. Yep. Yeah, sure, man. Take all my BP points. Oh, and you get BP from doing like challenges on the side. I forgot about that. He might use fire and maybe steel, but probably most likely fire based on hair and the clothes. Okay, he has a mag mortar, okay. Putting together a super spicy sandwich. You have to negotiate with the league club members around here to get what you need. Once you think you have all the ingredients. Alright. Yeah, you know what's even crazier than that? The fact that I don't even make any, like, food in this game like at all like it's super unnecessary you need to make a super spicy sandwich that should so basically lots of lots of peppers For, I don't need potato salad. Broader churro, marmalade and mustard. Ah, here we go. This guy. Dude, don't. Oh, that's so lame. Prosciutto and mustard. Chili sauce, three ingredients. Okay, let me see what you got. Oh, you know.
Do I actually have to hold on? Alright, I guess let me let me battle her and see what she's about. So I'm guessing we have to battle. I'm, I guess we have to do everybody, honestly. Okay, so that's one battle down, which I think I could use hers to get three other stuff. And give, give me the potato salad. Yeah, give me that. Ah, uh, yeah. Didn't really need that. Sure, thank you. Ah, see, there's a guy back here. Jalapenos. Jalapenos, what? I'm gonna battle you. I have no battle points. <clears throat> or blueberry points, or whatever they're called. Magmar's down. And like I said in the last part, I want a Magmortar and a Lelectivire. Those are two of my favorite Pokemon. But I really, really hope that like once you finish all this, you can still come back here and battle people, especially the Elite Four and the Champion. Because for those of you who want to do competitive, that'd be a great practice because they're all doing double battles. Jalapenos. Man, why would I need mayonnaise? Three ingredients if you give me something. Here, take potato salad. Okay, so, all right, so here's what I did, right? Uh, all I did was I come over here, I battled him for mayonnaise. Then you talk to him, and he gives you three, like, vinegar, something else, something else. All because the answers he gives you are the things you have, which I didn't pick up on that because I'm stupid, but that also makes no sense. Um, so now, uh, what does he want again?
Okay, I got more jalapenos. Okay, mustard. Trade for the mustard. See, now it's all coming together. Here's the mustard. I don't even know what this is. I got eggs too, which I don't need either. So, here you go. Okay, that's literally everybody. I'm pretty sure. Wait, do you have more mustard? Hold on, dude. Does she have more mustard? No, no, no. Hold on. Relax. Okay, no, no. That's it. That's literally it. That's all I can do. So now, let me try to cook now that I have everything. We'll find out in a second. Yeah, I have like two helpings of a uh, thing. Let me see. Jalapeno, jalapenos, onions. Chili sauce, mustard. That should literally be like too spicy now. No way. No way that counts as a drop. Are you serious? I just want to make sure I get the jalapenos on here. That's all I, that's all I really care about. <clears throat> I feel like it's a little bit off. The sandwich is terrible. <laughs> that sandwich looks terrible. I can't lie to you. Let's see what's gonna give us, or if it's gonna even gonna work. Why would you want that? Alright, so I'm guessing that works. But why would you want that? If it burns your entire mouth, like, that's not enjoyable at all. Alright, so we beat the Elite Trial. Alright, cool. Which that means now we can battle him. Hopefully, I can change my team really quick. Ah, oh, dude. Please let me change my team for like two seconds. No, no, no. Yeah, I'm already at. Hold up. Give me, give me like two seconds. Yeah. Don't worry. I got something for you. I'm gonna go over here. I'm gonna grab this guy. You're not gonna help me. Uh. What else I got in here? Hey, what was? 75. Ah, eh, sure. I'll put you in just to be safe. Alright, so I'll start off with... Actually, let me start off with you two, honestly. Why am I doing this? Alright, you two are gonna carry me to the finish. And I'll switch if this. Actually, you know what? You know what? No, let me, let me get iron thorns up here. Yeah. He'll open up with stealth rock and all that type of stuff. All right, let's go.
Although my Palkia is like 75, so he's kind of underleveled. It's a legendary. Shouldn't really matter. He's having way too much fun with this. Also, I like that he's a fire um, trainer when he's from the savannah biome. I guess that makes sense because it's hot. Alright, Talon Flame and a Rotom. Alright, he's starting off strong. Battle music is clean right now for sure. Mm, harsh sunlight and all that. So when he switches in, he'll be cooked. That's weird to have an executor when I. Assume he'd be fire. Let me let me hope a hurricane lands. Yes, let's go. Our right, executor is defeated. Tank that on the chin. Talonflame defeated. Two knockouts. And his prize Magmortar. Oh, and a camera up. Okay. Oh, yeah. Stealth Rock is coming to handy, man. Battle music is kicking right now, dude. Here, let me trash this. I don't think that berry is gonna help. Yeah. A legendary terrestrialized water attack? Come on now. Man, imagine wasting a whole berry. That's sad. Take one. Ooh, or not. Damn. That's fine, I have something. Let me just give Palkia some battle time. I've never used him since I caught him. Ooh, a Blaziken. Hold on. Yo, let Crispin cook a little bit, dude. So Blaziken is, is his star, okay. I will say his like pot gimmick is stupid.
Oh yeah, and I have Ray's special attack too. Yeah. All right, camera ups out of it. Also, I just realized that um, Palkia doesn't have spatial rend, which is weird. Wait, did he miss? Or am I tripping? Did he miss? I didn't even think he went. All right, Blaziken's defeated. Which means Crispin has been cooked. Yes, pun intended. Yeah, we did crank it all the way. I actually like his character. He's actually, he's a good dude. The pot gimmick is kind of stupid, but he, he's a good dude. The hair is fire too, also pun intended. That's a cool picture. Temper Flare. Okay, I've never heard of that. Spurred by desperation, the user attacks the target. This move is powerful. This move's power is doubled if the user's previous move failed. Oh, I don't like moves like that. It could work after like a double protect, I guess. So all I can say is crank up all the heat you want in the battle league. Alright, cool. And you left Mag Mortar far behind, dude. I feel like we're probably gonna have a phone call. Oh, no. Yo, champ of the making, yep. We used to all chow down on Christian's cooking after club activities, dude. To shake things up in the league club. All right, cool, cool. Good luck with the remaining th three. All right, I got you, man. Yeah, see, I'm liking Drayton, man. He's a cool dude. His jacket is still cool with a dog on it. All right. Well, that's one of the Elite Four members down. Um, not too difficult. Pretty fun. So the next one, uh, strong button. Next one I'm gonna take on is uh, this lady right here. Yeah. So I'm gonna start heading this way. But let me see something really quick. Yeah, I'm gonna try him in the one spot. Oh, let me actually see something, because maybe I can. Hold on, check summary. Let me see something. Ooh, or not. Dang, that sucks. Oh yeah, that's what I was gonna do for him too. Hold up. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna start switching people's builds around. All right, so which way is it? All 
Oh yeah, I was trying to take on a cleaver, I couldn't. It sucked. I'm still trying to figure out which button it was to. Wait, right, hold on. Cave. Why is this cave empty? It's kind of stupid. Fifty-six. Hold on. Nah, if I'm gonna do something low, I have to get a shiny. See, I try to shiny hunt that off screen. But let me keep going this way. All right, the canyon biome, which I'm pretty sure is gonna be full of rock types, maybe steel types as well. Armory, okay. Fracture. Swablu, all that. Crafty, okay. So this place doesn't have what I'm looking for either. There's an Elekid, I do like that. Today's the day. I'm trying to figure out what button was it that you can see what challenges you need to do. Because there was like a... Oh my god, dude. There was a thing that she said in the beginning where you can like see what battles what battles and Pokemon need to catch to get battle league points. 
Okay, I'm stupid. It was right on the D-pad. All right, catch one wild Pokemon. Uh, defeat ten wild Pokemon using auto battle. This will be my fifth right here. So you take a photo of a wild Pokemon. So. All right, let's go back to the terrarium, and we're gonna do some of these. So it's right on the D-pad. I wish I would have like. I wish it was more obvious than that. Also, can I take B? Like that point too. Okay, you know what? Actually, I know what I'm gonna do. Uh, I'm going to complete all these side tasks off screen. Then we're gonna take on the Elite Four in the next part. So, <laughs> I'll catch you guys in the next one. Thank you guys for watching. We took on one Elite Four member today. I beat them. It was Crispin. He was a fire guy in the Savannah biome. So now we're here in the Canyons biome and we're gonna take on her after this. So, I'll catch you guys in the next part. Thank you guys for watching.